So I finally got my hands on the brand new iPhone 8. I gotta tell you, I'm pretty surprised to see there were a lot more people at the Apple Store line than the previous year, um, at least in my experience. So that was kind of interesting. I was expecting just a few, you know, people at the 8 a.m. launch. But check it out, guys. I've already kind of activated, skipped that process for you guys, and I've got the box. I'm going to take the ceiling off this beautiful iPhone 8. Oof. Check it out, guys. Actually pretty interesting, that true tone rose gold, real rose gold right here. It's got ore copper, whatever finish you want to call it, but it's, it's pretty beautiful. One thing I have to say that's kind of interesting is there's no more um, of that, you know, F, whatever they say at the bottom, like designed in, um, you know, all the letters. It's just iPhone. That's the only word you're going to find on the back of the iPhone 8. Found that to be pretty interesting. So it is an all glass back, and then here's the front, of course, iOS 11. So we're going to be doing the standard hammer and knife test. I want to see how it does on this brand new model. Uh, of course, this isn't, you know, the crazy iPhone 10 or the iPhone X or anything, but I still want to see, you know, again, it's an all glass body. Uh, let's get it going, guys. So first thing I'm going to do... Just a few smacks with the knife, that's all it needs. So kind of surprised though, let's take a look. Um, I don't see any scratches yet. Pretty cool. Let's move on. Let's take a look at that. That's kind of more like it, you know, standard though, you got scratches on the side, you know, it's going to scratch. Um, let me go ahead and actually try and just do a few stabs with the knife. So this is around that point. This is kind of the same with the Galaxy Note, the, you know, the regular, the Galaxy S8. You're going to have that shatter that's going to go all around the back of the display in that um, spider web fashion but you know that's what happens you know when you do put that all glass on the back so durability may take a step down I do have to say though it seems like I'm taking a few much a uh, few more harder stabs for it to crack than the note uh, I think that that required a little bit less strength with the knife um, but regardless guys um, you know, the front didn't shatter, that's good. So let's move on to the knife or the hammer. So let's go ahead and do this. First of all, just dropping it. That's pretty high, so no cracks, that's good. Let's start a little bit more. And just one of those stronger cracks Kind of all you need as you guys can see as soon as i did that still works still works a really strange type of shatter i've never seen anything like that there's like it's it's like one big circle kind of interesting let's go ahead and continue shall we or do we just leave it in its misery okay that's interesting huh i wonder what this could be is it a secret portal is it back to the future? Is it, is it trying to tell something to us? What is it saying? You know, I'm not sure. And I think that just about wraps it up, guys. So I don't feel any um, any crazy heat or anything coming from the back or the battery. Obviously, that whole back is uh, completely shattered. It's crazy, just all those cracks everywhere. You can almost see that the glass is just, you know, like that's pretty interesting right here. When I did the hammer test on the Note, you, can't, you weren't able to see like these little areas where the glass is just 
completely coming off. So in this case, I can almost just sit here and just peel all the glass away. And then you'll just see the internals. Uh, so that's pretty cool, guys. That wraps it up. Thanks for watching. As always, stay tuned for more videos and peace out.